Ladies and gentlemen, you see him on Conan O'Brien, Comedy Central. Give it up for Dan St. Germain. How is everyone? Are you good? Good. It's good to be here. I'm glad to be here in Madison, Wisconsin. I live in L.A. now. I've lived in New York for about eight years. I think the big difference between New York and L.A. is that in L.A., people are addicted to living healthy, and in New York, people are addicted to working to death, you know? Like in L.A., it's like, I woke up, I thank the universe, I complimented my plants so they grew faster, I took a shower with Deepak Chopra, that soap endorsed by Deepak Chopra and Tori Amos. Opposing in New York, where it's like, I woke up, I thought about killing myself, I got on the subway, watched a homeless guy eat a pigeon, I got to work, got fired, got a new job, realized I was bisexual, saw a Rangers game, finished my novel, and tucked my kids to bed at night, because I'm a New Yorker and I'm going to keep doing this shit till the devil drags me to hell. Thank you. Or Madison, where they're like, eh, we're just nice to you and we drink. And I... I gotta say, I think I prefer that. I think I prefer people being nice to me. I just thought of this, the weirdest thing that's ever happened in my life. One time, I'm single, which is of no surprise to anyone. I had fucked up with my ex and I was bringing uh, flowers to her apartment and I walked out of the, I remember I got out of the subway, it was in New York City, and out of nowhere, out of the darkness, I swear to God, this 80 year old Polish man jumps out of the darkness, tries to grab my flowers, and I went, woo, like I made like this, the sound of like a scared like Halloween cat. Uh, he takes the flat, and I go, oh, and then he looks at me and he goes, ha, 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 you're a woman, not a man. He said that. I was like, what, does David Lynch have a prank show? What the fuck is happening? And then he came back again, and he tried to grab, the, and then again, he goes, ha, ha, you're a woman, not a man. And I go, I'm a man, I said, which no man has ever had to say that. I'm a man, I said that. And then I turn around, and there's a cop just standing there. And I, go, I turn to the cop, and I go, are you going to do something? <laughs> And he looks at this 80-year-old who's trying to take my... He goes, you know what? You do it. Here's the badge. This is the weirdest fucking shit I've ever seen. I don't know if it's a horror movie or some sex game that you guys have with each other, but I am no longer a cop anymore. You're the cop. You're the cop now. Congratulations. My last girlfriend left me to go work for Google in North California, so the worst part about that breakup was using other search engines. You think you're depressed? Try asking Jeeves something, okay? <laughs> hey, Jeeves, how far can I get this gun into my mouth? <laughs> <laughs>